This is Local Edition on Brad Pomerantz. Thank you so much for joining us. Our guest is Nicole Sherwin. She is really changing the face of the environmental movement, and that's why I wanted to bring her on today. I want to hear all about your move to make eco hip and not so crunchy anymore. Not so crunchy mm -hmm. indeed, Brad. Thank you so much. Please. Uh, so what I've done is developed a project called Green Lounge. It's an eco luxury experience. And what that means is I think, as you said, the crunchy granola Birkenstock way of people perceiving eco or being green or conscious is doesn't have to be that way. And um, I've worked a lot with celebrities and the media and worked on events for many, many years. So I wanted to create a vehicle where eco products could get into the hands of celebrities and forward thinkers and green technology business minds, um, but really in a hip, stylish, eco cocktail lounge environment. So it sounds like a blast, if I can <laughs> say. I want to go wherever you're talking about. Tell us Fantastic. about the eco lounge. Well, the basically, green lounge. the green lounge, um, it's basically uh, a lounge that travels. Uh, we, we're going to be hosting it every quarter, mm -hmm. but it also travels to film festivals, wow. gets attached to awards shows as the, like the VIP green lounge. And really, Sundance. Exactly. We're going the to. The Environmental Media Awards. Correct. Exactly. Now, let me ask you, though, it seems as if the environmental movement has done a very good job penetrating kind of the elite. One could call it the limousine liberal type. Yes. And then the flip side is, you know, the granola crunchies are still on board. Mm. What about kind of those in the middle? You know, they're not super wealthy. They're not limousine liberals, but they want to, you know, participate. How are you? How do you see penetrating that? group of people? Well, what I want to do is really invite the, everybody to this event so everybody mixes and can see that there's a place for everything. Mm -hmm. You know, everybody's trying to do their bit to create the consciousness and to really give back in some small way. And there's no one way to do it. There's every way is different and every way makes a difference. Now, you mentioned that you want to help brands get out yes. and, and get their message heard and be told in a approachable way yes do the brands want that or are you fighting to get them to come in <laughs> I I'm fighting to keep them out right now oh is that true it's really, really? fantastic I think what's happened is um, because of the economy everybody's advertising and marketing budgets have been slashed mm -hmm. so what this what this project does is allows is allows them to come in to uh, a vehicle that is sustainable and when I mean sustainable I mean it's it's it has longevity because we're going to be doing events throughout the year at all different very very high-end uh, arenas where people want to get into and part of their package is we have a very very aggressive marketing and PR campaign attached to us um, that is going to be elevating their brands uh, through the media, through national media, through viral marketing, through business to business networking. And at the same time, are environmental products priced in a way that the regular person can't access? Because I think that had been the perception. Yes. Is it the reality? I believe that 18 months ago, no. But what's happening is there's so many new products on the market every single day, it's tough for me to even keep up See? with them, that uh, the competitiveness has brought the price down. So I do believe that even being eco-chic and eco-fabulous, everyone can do it. There's a way. In our final moments, you walk the walk, you talk the talk on the web with CelebritySoul.com. Tell us about it. Well, so I, I um, created Celebrity Soul also to, everybody interviews celebrities. They want to know, you know, what they're wearing on the red carpet, who they're dating, what film they're doing. I want to f interview their soul. Mm -hmm. I want to know what inspires them. I want to know how they're using their celebrity to do good in the world and give back. So Celebrity Soul really is about interviewing celebrities' souls to inspire others to make a difference in the world. You're an inspiration as well. Thank you for being such a wonderful world citizen. Oh, we appreciate it. Thank you, Brad. For Local Edition, I'm Brad Pomerantz. Back to CNN Headline News.